G'day folks, and today we're at the Yung Yang Temple. Yang Yang Temple. Yang Yang Temple, is it my dear? Yeah. So we're going to go in there and check it out and see if we can see Buddha and uh, and see this beautiful place. Yeah, it's just a uh, uh, beautiful garden, this lake, and uh, you even can, uh, if you don't need go to temple, and uh, for praying, you can just walk around and uh, look around and uh, make it's a very good... beautiful place, my dear. Yeah, very beautiful. It's garden and trees and flowers and a small, uh, cute bridge uh, across the lake and yeah. the statues about uh, uh, about Buddha, about uh, uh, different gods. I don't know how to right. Yeah, yeah. And. Uh, and everywhere you can see a little boards uh, for explaining what you can see here and how you see on the map it's uh, just uh, uh, really good and big place yeah. for walking for relax of course uh, because here is very quiet and should we go and explore my dear and see yeah of course all right then come on my dear let's go and have a look at the yang yang temple beautiful my dear so far very peaceful just look out upon the pond birds just beautiful <music> yeah so even here at the temple it looks like they've got a um, like a small orchard where they grow some of their own fresh fruit it could be, I don't know, it could be an apple pear or a peach, something like that. They've even got fig tree. Got some beautiful figs, they've got a few figs around, so. They're pretty self-sufficient here, in that way. And uh, yeah, just a beautiful place. Such an open, open space. And uh, yeah, many people can come and, and visit. It's definitely, definitely worth coming to, to uh, to have a look at the Yun Yun Temple anyway, so we'll keep exploring and, and show you some more around and uh, that's pretty good, come on. Just amazing place. So look, look at all this folks, all the lotuses, flowers. And when they open up, they'll look amazing. Look at that. So beautiful. So from up here, we get a pretty good view of all the place and all the surroundings and the ground. Beautiful pond, we've even got the uh, waterfall over there, the statue, and then the temple up there behind us. We're on the bridge at the moment, it crosses over the water. Beautiful place, my dear. Yeah, and one year ago, when we were here, yeah. uh, it was not so, uh, so full, I don't know. Uh, it was like, uh, uh, it was uh, the end of building this place and yeah. now it's all changed and uh, and so many more flowers in the pond all the yeah, lotus leaves it's, it looks uh, more full more rich and uh, 
amazing I, and I think it's the next year it will be it's even just, better I think it's every year it will just more and more beautiful yeah. it's a very good garden and I, I so like it they did a uh, very big work about this place very good place I think people need the same places for relaxing for be alone for some time for thinking about something important yeah very good There's good peace and quiet here yeah very important and places, uh, yeah. serenity so you can certainly just sit in little spots even little spots like that down there and you've got the pond around and you can think about whatever you need to and take some time for yourself but uh, yeah this is open on a Sunday to the public uh, from 9.30, 9.30 I think, till 2. So you've got about four and a half hours. On a Sunday you can visit, that's the only day that it's open, so you've definitely got to get down and uh, check out this place. Yeah, I think all the flowers here will open up soon. And it'll be like magic, magical, magical to see. Yeah, so beautiful place. And of course they got the local geese here. Always squawking. They were actually asleep when we walked in, you might have seen. Looked like statues. Beautiful little boardwalk around the pond. Just beautiful. Surrounded by the beautiful lilies. So just another spot here. This is in the middle of the pond, that little area. So we've got a seat and uh, yeah, you can just look over the grounds. So beautiful, peaceful. People can come and say their wishes or prayers and they leave a few coins. Beautiful. Even a beautiful spot if you just want to come and take some pictures. Like this gentleman. There's so much to see. So quiet, so peaceful. One, come and pray to, I guess, and leave a donation for the monks. So here we are coming up to the temple. It's 
quite magnificent. And if you want a light, you can. So it's a pretty cool place. Definitely, definitely check it out. Don't forget, Sunday morning, 9.30 till 2, it's open. So it's definitely worth coming to have a look at. Yeah, so they've even got places like the library up here. Got the meditation hall. Yeah, it's got some beautiful little gardens as well. Up the other end. Nice, Ira. Very cosy and tender. Gorgeous little gardens in here. Uh, the serenity is incredible. This is like the conference room. And of course the library. All right, we're gonna head around to the front now. But just have a look at these gardens. Beautiful. So that's where they get their water from. Or wash things, their pots and pans. Yeah, so it's been quite good coming and showing everyone. Beautiful place, the Yin, Yun Yang temples here in Nari Warren. Yeah, so that's just about all we've got to show today, folks, of the Yun Yang Temple. I hope you enjoyed the journey. There's a little bit more just down here. We're going to have a look at before we sign off for the day, but yeah, it's a good place. Beautiful. Lots of open space. Beautiful garden. With the waterfall, all the flowers, the lotuses in the pond, the temples you can do. You can do it all here, folks, so definitely worth coming and checking this place out. Let us know if you've been here, drop a comment. Let us know if you what you thought of the place. But definitely, definitely worth a visit. Mm, a few statues. Maybe not so happy one. Yeah, so they've got about six in here. Look at the roof. 
pretty cool. I guess they place the statues in here and that's their view out the door and it looks straight up to the temple. So the other entrance into this little temple, the entrance room, you got a little Buddha again. So I suppose here you can light one of them and say a prayer. So we're on our way out folks. So that's the entrance to the little one with the two lines. I suppose they give protection. Yes, I suppose on the way out this could have been like the tea house to grab a cup of tea. But not open at the moment. Yes, yeah, so uh, that's the Yun Yang Temple folks out here in Nari Warren and we're on our way out now. So it was, a, it was a good day coming to bring this to you and show you. Alright folks, so we're going to leave it there. I hope you enjoyed the tour with us. Don't forget, subscribe, give it a thumbs up, ring the bell so you know when the next video is coming. And until next time, ciao for now, and we'll see you in the next video.